Hello, everybody. I hope this is working. Hello, hello. Oh my goodness. <laughs> my wardrobe is open. Right, let's pretend it's not started yet. No one's seen it yet. No one's seen it yet. No one's seen that the wardrobe's open. Brilliant start. Brilliant start. Here she is. Let's pretend it just started. Hello. Hi, everyone. Let me just. Here we are. Hello, hello. Right. If I turn that one off, I'm a bit new to this, so let me just see what I can turn off on my laptop to make this as smooth as possible. I am going to try and upload this as well afterwards. If you're watching this in the future, it's not live for you, please do excuse um, some of these little like teething problems that were happening. Having. Okay, everyone's saying hello. So I feel like if you're saying hello, you can see me. Can you see me? Am I there? Hello, hello. Uh, okay, Brogan says we can see and hear you. Great, thank you. Oh, Laura says the lighting lights. Laura, look at this. I wasn't going to swizzle this round because I wanted this to feel a smooth experience for you, but can we just, can we just? It says ooh la la. I know that's not showing well, but it says ooh la la. Um, I'm also just going to give my lens a little clean here. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry guys, just wash your face. There you go. There you go. I don't know if that's made any difference, but I feel good about it. We'll move like this so that you don't see. Oh, that is nice. That is nice. Hello, welcome. Um, there are a lot of you here. Um, thank you so much for coming to the craft night. I'm so excited to have you. I thought this would be a really fun idea. I've never done something like this on YouTube. Typically, um, typic sorry, I've got a thing flashing up there. Typically, I find it quite hard to do things and talk at the same time, so I've always avoided this. But I thought if this is just for fun, and I'm not feeling the pressure, like I don't have a camera crew here, obviously, um, and I'm not working for a brand at the moment, I just thought this might be nice. And also, if you guys are crafting as well, then it would feel like quite a nice community spirit. So, my first question for you is what craft are you doing or are you just watching for company either way absolutely fine I'll read some of these out and then I'll tell you what I'm going to be doing so we've got Georgia Ruby is doing diamond art oh my god I have recently bought a diamond art packet and I'm so excited to do this if this live goes well maybe I could do this on another live um wow the light just went a bit funny there I've got a little ring light here should I see if changing it makes much difference this is gonna be really chatty well that's that's no good um what do we think to that or do we like that that's nice that's good a bit blue let me know <laughs> this feels very very olden days sprinkle of glitter vibes doesn't it i like it like that um lauren is making a cardigan um Frias is thinking of doing some colouring, stained glass jewels. Oh my god, this is going so slow, uh, so quick. Crochet, bracelets for Taylor Swift, that's from Lily Camera Action. Um, sticking stamps in my stamp book, that's Flow. Um, doing paint by numbers from Anya, oh, I love paint by numbers. Um, Abby's doing her makeup and then crocheting. We've got knitting, we've got Christmas cards. Is anyone doing a Christmas craft? I guess if you're like really into the crafts, you need to like crack on with doing that start now mindful coloring um knitting a baby cardi that's becca is that for you or for someone else becca um clay sophie's doing clay sophie i'm imagining like a wheel i'm thinking i'm thinking like ghost i'm thinking like mm. <laughs> that's what i'm thinking um scrapbooking for Soph. paint by stickers book oh i like those um Anna is doing a university essay you can't possibly do an essay and have a live on at the same time mosaic coasters painting a landscape um turn on the slow mode someone says what is slow mode I maybe I need slow mode right I'm going to talk to you about what I'm going to be making can anyone guess I think it's obvious and I also said it on Instagram uh, I am going to be making uh, bracelets because I flipping love beading I've got all of my bead supplies here 
Um, but what I thought I'd start off with is an Eras bracelet from the Eras Tour because that's going to be using chunky beads. And if I'm honest, I was feeling a bit nervous about this live and I thought I can't be using like my tiny, tiny beads whilst I'm feeling nervous because I won't be able to like pick them up. Um, how can I best, oh look, I don't want you to be able to see this. I don't want you to know that there's an ironing board. Now, now you don't know it's there. Now I bet you're imagining all sorts is there, but not an ironing board. If I do this, oh, oh, hello. Oh, hello, oh, but <laughs> guys, what would you prefer? Would you prefer the beading of the table or on the table, or would you prefer my face? I don't mind if you don't want my face. I, I literally don't mind either way, but can I just have some votes? Lindsay Smile says face. Because what I can't do is this. <laughs> this is going to be too hard. <laughs> beading, face, face, table, face, beading, face. <laughs> okay, the votes are on face. <laughs> but I can swizz you down to see the beading quite a lot, quite often. So I'll just do some beading and then I'll show you. I'll, I'll hold it up and show you it. Okay, for the Era's Tour Brexit. I don't even have tickets, so I'm just going to have to give this to someone that's going. Um, but I know my manager, Megan, wants to go. So, Megan, if you're watching, did you get tickets? Are you going? Please, my really big pony beads. That is a satisfying sound. Oh, I really like that. It's like rain. Um, and I was thinking of going for these purple colours. I'm going to just have the word eras. But what colours would you do for um just your basic your basic eras tour bracelet these are the letters i'm going for they are square cubed beads um so it's basically an asmr at this point yeah it is um blue pink purple red purples darts could do a rainbow for eras tour could do um someone says Friez, how do you pronounce your name? Friezen says if this is going to be a regular thing, you should get two cameras. I should. I need a proper setup, but for right now, it's the webcam. Okay, rainbow. Lots of people are saying a colour from each album. Sam, I don't know what what colour each album is. I don't know. Shiny, do a colour for each era. Guys, I don't know the colours of the eras. I just like some of the songs. There's not a Taylor Swift song that I haven't liked, in fairness. But I don't, I don't, I'm, I'm like a low-level Swifty. Um, oh, it's Freesia. It's pronounced free, Freesia. Freesia. Sorry. Um, lots of people are saying red. Why is it? Okay, purple is great. Speak Now TV just came out. Not TV, Taylor's version. We're going purple. Thank you. Right. We need to find eras. Have any of you started your crafts yet? Or have you just been chatting in the comments? Right. E. Fantastic. This is going to be slow work if the, if the letters are long. For eras tour, do I write era, just E-R-A, or with the S as well? And do I write the word tour? Someone let me know. Oh, someone said hi, sprinklerinos. Aloha, sprinklerinos. Does that bring back nostalgia for anyone? You know what I probably should have done? Selected the beads before I started. But half the joy of the crafting is finding your little beads. Here, look, I think we can have some um, non-face at the moment. Excuse my wires. Excuse all of this. Right, we've got an E and we've got an A. And we've got an S. We just need a cheeky little R. Oh, come on, R. Where are you, R? How are you all getting on? Is anyone else doing bracelet make? Ah, yes. There we go. Put you back on now. Is anybody else doing bracelets or beading? Um, what crafts do you do? to calm down this is my calm down craft there's lots of crafts that I like doing um but this is definitely like my switch off your brain calm down craft normally I would spend a long time choosing the beads because that's half the fun but I feel a bit pressured because I don't want you to be bored I can't talk and choose beads at the same time like my brain is like no <laughs> too many things at once 
and I felt panicked there. I was like, oh my God, if I don't talk, will they all just sign off and stop watching? Um, oh, Sarah says, such nostalgia. I've been around since you were pregnant with baby glitter. Oh my God. Um, someone there made bracelets for their children's teachers. That's really, really sweet. I love that. Um, do you mind if I'm terribly rude and just check my phone? It's just that Darcy has messaged me and I don't like to miss her messages if she's not here. Um, she said, enjoy your craft live. Love you lots. I'm going to bed soon. Love you to the end of the moon. I'm back again. I'm just going to reply because I don't want her to feel like I haven't replied because I don't think she's watching this. So we're just going to have a small break. You, you, you do your crafting. I'm just going to quickly message my little doodles back. Um, Tomorrow, sleep tight. Okay. There we go. I can rest easy now. I could see that something had flashed up from Darcy and I was like, oh, I need to check it, I need to check it. Right, we've got our eras, our little doobly doos there. I'm gonna go for purples. I think I'm gonna go for the um the sheer purple because I just think that looks really nice um on with um the string running through it and I'm thinking it might be nice to put in some like a bit of excitement you know so I'm thinking I've got some stars over there hang on let's get some of these out I like to have them all out and I also have a specific a special bead mat where the beads don't all like roly-poly wibble wobble around which is quite good if I go like this I wish I could get you further back oh it's the ironing board again it's even the ironing board oh my god um what you're saying you're making a pink cro here with pink crochet in derby um blah, blah, blah. oh hi brogan everyone say hello to brogan do any of you watch brogan tate she's just uploaded this evening i believe brogan what did you upload tonight i know that you uploaded i think at six he said um but i think you would really like her channel um how do you close off your bracelets i'll show you that um we need a hashtag for sharing our artwork on insta yeah what are oh, love broken what should our hashtag be you let me know um these are the stars i bought these creatology where have i bought these i've got a feeling i bought these at tiger tiger or somewhere like that all different colors there what should we go for? I'm thinking maybe the purples to match, or should I go for yellows so that it's a bit standout? What would you do, purples or yellows? Oh, sprinklerino crafts. Yeah, we could do that. Um, we were both on the cruise together last year. Oh, why don't they do more crafting? Although well, they should do more crafting, shouldn't they? What should we go for? Hey, look. What should we go for? I feel like pink is not the one. Maybe the purples would look nice or green. No, definitely not green. Maybe a couple of yellows to keep things exciting. What do you think? Um, Louise Sparkle Craft Club, yes. Sparkle yellow. People are saying yellow. Okie dokie. We'll go for yellow. That pains me to put those there because I really want to just put them away. Um, I'm going for this is the elastic string that I really like, specifically 0.8, and I also like it on a chunky reel. I'm not a big fan of it when it comes in a reel like this, even though, hang on, even though this is also 0.8, can you see that they both say it uh, there and there, I just don't like the vibe, I just don't like this, this, I don't know why I don't like it, I just, feels messy and stressy to me. So we're going for a chunker. I love it, thick and wide. Uh, and then I like to put it here on the left hand side and then I don't cut it. This is the trick, don't cut it straight away. So that way when you put a string on, a bead on, it's not gonna go anywhere, like it can't fall off. Just leave it like that until it's time. All right, let's come back up here. Bree says, or Bri, Bree says, oh, this is so cozy. Yeah, I'm enjoying this. Oh, bloody iron. Do you know what? Should we just embrace the iron? What are your thoughts on the iron? <laughs> Messy and stressy sounds like my personality, says Louise Stewart. Yeah, <laughs> it's kind of mine as well. Um, 
Holly, what would you recommend for someone who would like to start bracelet making with their uh, carers for winter craft? How do we get started? Okay, great. I would recommend you buy elastic string um, in a 0.8 thickness. I buy this on Amazon and I would just go on Amazon and or whatever website you like and I would just type in bead kit or beads. I love it when they come pre um, packaged out like this. Pony beads are your big hold beads, if you want a wide hole. <laughs> um, pony beads are your bigger beads and they're really easy to use. They're not fiddly fiddly. But if you want something a little bit smaller, these are seed beads. These are actually quite big seed beads, um, but you can get really, really tiny beads. If you want to go really, really tiny with beads, I wouldn't suggest using elastic thread. I would use a thread called Nymo, that's N-Y-M-O, and it's like a reinforced cotton. And the teeny tiny beads are um, Delica beads, really small, or Mayuki beads, very small. They're Japanese, typically made of glass, and they're very dainty. Um, but if you're using those, I wouldn't just string them on. I'd be like doing stitch work with them. But the bracelet making we're doing tonight, we're literally just stringing beads onto elastic thread. So get yourself some thread, good pair of scissors um, and a kit and that's you done. Right, let's actually get making, shall we? Um, my two years class this year loves beading, both boys and girls. Oh, my year two class, got it. You're a teacher, you teach year two, I got it. Let the iron run free. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, have you made any jewellery for yourself? Yes, I'm not even wearing it. I'm going to make myself something tonight. Um, I'm so happy I stumbled on this live from Andrea. Oh, hello, hello. Um, hey, Louise. When and how did your love for crafting start? Enjoying the live. And that's from Emily. Thank you, Emily. Well, I grew up around a crafter. My mum was a crafty lady. She used to do pressed flowers. Um, and sell them at craft fairs and then she worked out that she could actually make more money if she ran the craft fair like my mum was an entrepreneur genius she worked out she could make more money if she ran the craft fair so she started organizing them and she sold in fact I have an example of some of her work to hand she sold pressed flowers she would grow flowers pick them, press them, and then arrange them. And this is an example of some of her work that she did there. So my mum will have grown those flowers. Oh, this is nice, like a bit of my mum is on the live. She'll have grown those flowers and then, you know, arrange them. And in the eighties, people flipping loved a bit of this um, on their walls. It says, do not display this flower picture in damp atmosphere or direct sunlight. And if you look really, 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 really closely, it says DJA here. So she made this before she was married to my dad because my dad's surname starts with a P. Um, and, that, and my mum wrote that, DJA, Diana Jane. Um, so my mum's name was actually Diana, but she liked to be called Jane. So that's what the DJ is. Right, let's swizzle you like this, so you can see what you're making. I've done, I try and, I'm quite precise, like I try and measure things out. So I know that the right width for a wrist is the length of this, roughly. So I've done five, um, five pony beads, then the star, and then I think I'll do four pony beads again. Does it bother you when I don't talk? It's just really hard to talk and think at the same time. Eras. Did any of you get tickets to the Eras tour? I have never seen Taylor Swift live, but seeing all the excitement and the hype on TikTok for her tour made me want to see her live. Right, so now I'm gonna look at this and be like, hmm, that is not quite, um, it's not quite right. So I might take eras off and just put another bead and just do five and five. Well, I think that will probably be about right. Let's see what you're saying. Oh, Marty got tickets. Um, Jack doesn't mind if I go a bit quiet. Thank you, appreciate that. Um, 
Hello, darling, says Disney Villager. Oh, hello, how are you? I don't know who you are. You came to my book tour. How long ago was that? Four years ago, I remember. How's your little girl doing? Um, Melissa says she's crafting. That is good. Um, oh, Tiger got tickets. Tiger Lily got tickets. Oh, my goodness. Holly got two VIPs. Well done. Okay, so I'm going to measure this out. And now I can see that, yes, that's roughly halfway. So now I know that it's five and five. Um, string these on. This... This is a pretty basic one. I'm already feeling like maybe this is a bit boring. I'm excited to get going with some other ones, but you'll have to not mind me talking. <laughs> right, where are you? Oh, Disney Villager, four years ago now. She's fine, thank you. She'll be four in September. Wowie, wowie, time flies, doesn't it? Have any of you watching ever come to any of my book tours or lives or Louise Live or anything like that? I need two more of them. Lovely chubbly. Um, I'm thinking about doing another live. Um, I got off the wait list last week, but all remaining tickets were £600. Wow. £600 is a lot. Someone says, how many beads do you use to avoid it looking sparse? Um, I'll fill the whole width of a wrist with beads. I don't leave any gaps. I just basically just go until it's full. Right. So... That should be about right there. I don't love this. I'm not excited about this. I feel like this is just a little bit boring. But, you know, we had to get started somewhere, didn't we? Right. So I'll leave about this much here because I like this. It's a little bit wasteful, but I like the safety of knowing I'm going to tie a good knot. So I'll probably leave about, how much is that? I don't know. Five inches, roughly. And then this is where I cut the other side. I just use these really tiny little Revlon scissors, they're little nail scissors, but they do a good job of cutting elastic string. And then, right, so tying off bracelets. I like to do a little under and over tie and squeeze, twist it round so that you're tying in the opposite direction and do a little under and over tie, squeezy, squeezy, squeezy. And then I'll pull it, and do a little like loopy roundy knot. <laughs> These are the proper words for a knot, let me assure you. And then you pull it, pull it, pull it to make sure that it sits on the under and over knottage, like so. Hang on. Doink, 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 doink. And then I'll do another under and over and then turn it around and do another under and over because then I feel like it's truly secure. You probably don't need to do that many knots, but I live in fear. So I like to, and then, ch -ch -ch -ch, then I just give it a little, ch -ch 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 -ch. yes, she looks good. My boring basic bracelet. Let's make something exciting next. Um, and then I just snippy, snippy off the elastic as close to the knot as possible, like so. And then I put those in my little rubbish bag under the bin. Boop, 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 boop. We've got our Eras bracelet. Megan, if you've got tickets, if any of my friends that I know that I'm going to see have got tickets, this is for you. Okay, I'm just check that Darcy hasn't replied. She has. Bear with. Um, she says, how have you done that during your live? I'm messaging you in my live. There's only one person on earth that I would message during my life, and <laughs> it's Darcy. Right. Let's see. Um... Oh, Brogan. Brogan says, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you're enjoying it. Thank you. Yes, please do. I'm not actually watching any of the stats here. Um, I'll see at the end. I don't even know. I can see how many people. Can I see how many people are watching? I, not really. I, I don't know what I'm looking at. I'm looking at some sort of numbers. <laughs> I can see what the chat rate is. Uh, what's the chat rate? No idea. Um, oh, Brogan, she says, 805 people here. Okay, you could all see. <laughs> oh, Imagine 805 people in a room doing their crafts. That's such a lot. That is such a lot of people in one room. It freaks me out a little bit. Um, da -da -da. Um, I'm working on writing my new book whilst watching. Love typing with background news. Oh, that's nice. Can you make this craft night a regular thing, please? Me and my sister are loving it. Yes, 
Um, can you do a close-up of the Eras bracelet? Yeah, I can. I just think it's very exciting, guys. Um, here you go. It's just some sparkly square beads that say Eras, or cubes, I should say. And then just um, clear purple pony beads. And then just these little gold yellow stars just to add a little bit of interest. Okay, next up, I am going to make a bracelet for my friend Brogan because I knew she would be watching. And I also knew that I have beads I feel are very Brogan vibes. So something you might not know about Brogan, or you might do if you watch her videos a lot, is she loves the coast and the sea. Um, she lives near the coast, so she often goes to the beach and things like that. And also, she, like me, flipping loves a cruise. Um, she's an actual water baby. Like, she does a lot of, like, water... <laughs> so, water sports. <laughs> not like that. Uh, when she goes away, she, like, gets in the water a lot. She's not nervous of the sea like I am. And I knew I had these beads. So I thought, yes, these will be a bit of bee. Um, so, these are new... Oh, these are nice. Okay, so let me just tip them out into this. That was a nice sound, wasn't it? Let me just take this. Come with some string, but I'm not keen on this string. So these are little glass iridescent fishy beads. How cute are these? I think they look like the sea. They're very ocean colours. I think that's Whoa, I think they're really, really pretty. Brogan, if you don't like them, <laughs> don't don't say it. Pretend you do. Um, but I just thought these were really cute. There's such a little variety of them. I bought these on Amazon. Hang on. Let's just... Oh, yeah. Look at them. They look really, really nice. I love them. Oh, Brogan says, I love them. So we're going to go for some of those. Um, hmm. Also, I think for some accent spacer beads, we're going to go for gold. Um, although, Brogan, are you a silver girly? Brogan, I feel like you're a silver girly, aren't you? Your wedding ring that you've had made in your engagement ring, I think, are white, gold, or silver. Um, maybe we'll go for silver spacers. We've got all the right colours until I can silver. She said silver. I knew it. So we'll go for silver spaces. Um, and then in terms of lettering, I think we will do lettering. And I think we might just do... Did something happen to my computer then? No, I thought I saw a glitch out the corner of my eye and freaked out. Um, I think we... Oh, we've got stars as well. No, we're not going to have stars and fish. Look, I've got so much in here. Let's swizzle you down so you can enjoy the joys of all of this. Oh. Um, so, I want to find some nice letters. Otherwise, I'm just going to do a B because I think these are too pretty to have loads of lettering all around them. Oh, these would make for nice spaces, actually. They're quite neutral. Although I think some of those as well. Here we go. Look at these for letters. Although they are gold, she won't mind, I'm sure. Right, let's find some like navy and blues for B. Maybe we could do a B and B for Brogan and Benji. How about that for, for fun times? Right. Guys, so what should we do? Should we do her whole name? Should we do Brogan, like B and B? Do we have ampersands? No, we might have to do an X. I'll get the X out just in case. Let's see. Oh, someone said, Lara has said, don't forget Bonnie. Lara. Oh, Brogan, Benji and Bonnie. Okay, we might, we might have to do BBB. If I write BBB in a row, can I just check that it doesn't mean anything else? Because sometimes, like, anagrams mean other things. And if I don't want it to mean something dodgy. Um, oh, Moomin says, I'm currently crocheting a little pumpkin. How cute. Um, Gigi says, Lara Joanna, oh my god, hi, yes. Um, what well, I'm gonna do, unless BBB means anything, it means better business bureau. Broken likes business, she won't mind that. We'll have BBB, right? Let's try and find different colors of the B. Bear with me. If you can, oh, I was gonna say, if you can all see it, here we go. We're gonna find B. 
bee. We've got one bee already in a good colour. I would quite like a dark coloured bee because I think that will go nicely with the little fishy beads. There's another bee. It's another light colour. But that's it. Oh, okay, we've got this one. That's like a greeny colour. Yes, but can we find anything better? I'm going to gamble it. I'm going to tip some more out. Bear with. I'm sorry that I don't have any silver lettering broken. I might do in my drawer. But we're here now. Okay, here's a darker bee. Yes. Yes. Very happy with that setup. All righty. Let's just tip these back in. Tidy desk, tidy mind, and all of that. Just enjoy the ASMR. You know what we can do? Okay, whilst you're laying down like that, I'll lay out all the others on the mat for the satisfying vibes. Right, I'm going to do this at kind of random because I don't want to like pre-select colours. I'm going to get a little mix. That'll be way too many. Let's mix it all up. Just put some back in. Mm, I feel like more blue. Not very random at all, is it? There we go. And then I'm also going to go for these neutrals. Now I bought these ages ago for my friend Lara, who said she wanted neutrals to go with her watch. And I made one and I really hated it. So in fact, I usually keep my made ones in here. No, here's one I made earlier. Um, I really, really hated it. So I'm gonna start it again. Right, I'm gonna put these little neutral guys in to the mix like so. I haven't quite decided what I'm going to, oh, let's just tip you all out. There we go. I haven't quite decided how this is going to come together, but that's where the magic is. Okay, thank you all for sticking with me whilst I'm not filming my face, but actually maybe it's nicer not having my face. Right, we're going to go for silver. Little spacers, and I think, these tiny ones would be a nice fit. Tiny beads, tiny um, circles, like so. I always end up using more spaces than I think I'm going to. What time are we on? Oh my gosh, I can't believe it's half eight. How is everyone getting on? Um, Dilly Bopper watching whilst making a flower bouquet from Lego. Oh, Lego does count as crafting, yes. Um, how do the fish string on? I will show you, I will be two seconds, but I tell you, if you lay out all your beads now, you save yourself so much time in the long run, I promise. Okay, I also feel like these are gonna need something special around them. Hmm, how are we gonna do this? Maybe these guys? No, I'm not going to overcomplicate it. I'm going to keep it simple, otherwise it starts to look really messy. Right. We're going to get our elastic string in the point 0.8, always point 0.8. Point 0.6 will snap and point 0.9 is too thick. And then we're just going to start. Um, so whenever I have... <laughs> hi, guys. Whenever I have um, something like this like a fish or I've had hearts or I've had gummy bear beads. I like to <laughs> thread through the bum and out the mouth. Um, I don't know why, but it works well. Right, so fish on. Then I'm gonna go for a neutral. I'm gonna try not to think too much about what color I'm picking up. You are, you have a tiny hole. Um, then I'm gonna go for a little silver. Just gonna look at, I'm gonna have a look at how this looks because I might change the little spacer beads round and then another neutral. Oh, I'm glad I chose a bead with such a tiny, tiny hole and then up the fish bum and out its mouth. And let me have a look at that. No, I'm gonna do it the other way. So I want to do two silvers and then a neutral. I think that will look nicer. Worth having a little fiddle with and then once you've got it right, you've got it right, so. 
Can you see what I'm doing here? Is this a good view for you? Would you like me to change the camera at all? Let me know. Right, neutral. And then taking a little silver spacer. And then we're going to take a fishy, pop the bum out the mouth. Whoop. Yeah, that's much nicer. Oh, I like that. That's pretty. I like it. Um, going to try and draw Louise whilst I watch, says um, Holly Martin. Oh, thank you. Jodie Jackson says, this is so relaxing. Alfie Days, I see you and I see your comment. I am ignoring that comment. This is a live craft party and that kind of attitude will not be tolerated. It's been years. I'm past it. I'm not interested in your hammy comments. Not today, Satan, not today. I'm gonna get back to my bracelet making. Thank you very much. This is a calm, pleasant, safe space. Your ham is not welcome here. Hope you're well, love you lots. All righty, here we go. So we're gonna go again with our silver. <laughs> oh good, everyone's gone crazy in the comments for the ham. Brilliant, thanks Alfie, nice to see you. Share online, will you please? Get my views up, thanks awfully. Oh my goodness, this is relaxing. How is everyone else getting on with their um, craft projects? Where are you up to? What are you doing? Diamond painters, how are you doing? Because that is a long old craft. Crocheters, I've never crocheted anything in my life, but it seems like the most popular thing ever. Um, how are you getting on? No, silver. Um, yeah, someone says, what kind of craft is Alfie doing? What kind of craft are you doing? H spacer A spacer M. I know that means something. Oh, it means ham. Thank you. Appreciate that. Thanks, Lara. <sighs> Shot. Right. Would you prefer? I talked through this. We'll put it back. Would you prefer to like what? 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 Blah 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 blah. We've reached that point in the live, guys. Um, do you want face or do you want the table? Let me know. Do you okay. Soon we'll have to put the. Yeah, we're going to have to think about putting the BBB in a second. Yeah, we're going to go for that now. So I'm going to go for, in fact, take this guy off and I'm going to do them here. Table, table. Candice votes for a wet ham bracelet. Candice, no. <laughs> Frankly, no. Right. Table, table, table. Keep the camera like this so you were done stringing the beads on. Okay. Front it a bit more like this. Mm -hmm. There you go. Um, this is a bit where I usually play around as well because I want to decide whether I want to put like spaces between the Bs, between the letters. I think I will because each of these letters. Do you know what? Just because it's going to really annoy me, I am going to look to see if I've got any silver beads because I think I do. And silver spaces. Gold beads, it's not the one, you know? Right, bear with. Why don't you talk to Alfie about ham? We'll love that. We've got normal letters, but I know that I've got silver letters somewhere and it's gonna bother me. Oh, I think they're downstairs. I think they're downstairs. Do I want to just do normal letters? Let's have a look what it looks like. It's going to just bother me. It's going to really bother me. If I didn't have the live on, I'd run downstairs. Alfie, can people watching buy a bracelet and can you custom make it and send it to them? No. No, they can't. Um, sorry. Uh, Alfie, would you like a bracelet? I'll make you one. Um, loving that all these other YouTubers are here. I won't lie, having other YouTubers here is stressing me out somewhat <laughs> because this is just a life of a woman making a bracelet in her bedroom and it's freaking me right out. Um, right. Beck says, yes, Alfie, this is an amazing idea. That's why Alfie said that, so that everyone then wants one, and I cannot provide that, I'm afraid. Right, we've got these beads. 
Brogan, what beads do you want? I know you don't really care, but it bothers me not to get it exactly perfect. We're going to stick to what we're doing. But look, I did find, I did pick out these as well. Alfie, I remember when you were on FaceTime yesterday and you said you'd make 15 customs for, <laughs> yeah, okay, lovely. Thank you, Alfie. I did find these, but I just don't feel like these fit the fish nicely. <laughs> Brogan says she's grateful for anything. Um, Alfie Days is such a troll. That's right, he is. Right, we're going back to the beads. We're going back to the beads. Let's just finish this bracelet off because we've started it now. Let's thread it through. This will be finished in no time. Right, so we're going for B for Brogan, B for Benji, and B for Bonnie. Bonnie is Brogan and Benji is little doggo. Here we go. And then I'm just putting silver spaces in between it just to give it a little bit of excitement. And then we'll go back to the naturals. The pressure of the comments now <laughs> it's too much for me um you can run downstairs we don't mind says sophie no because i don't know exactly where they are downstairs and then i'll be like tearing things apart but next time i'll make sure i've got like every single bead known to man up here or i might do another craft next time thinking about diamond painting i say next time that's if we want to make this a regular thing but i'll have a think afterwards i shall have a reflect okay we're going to go for another fish now. And remember, up the bum and out the mouth. I want to keep them all swimming in the same direction. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Oh, I'm pleased with that. That's very nice. I'll measure it on here. Seven inches is about what you want for a bracelet for someone's wrist. That's nice. I think we'll probably get two more fish on there. Um, is there anyone else doing bracelet making? Oh, someone says, please, is anyone lolling it through the bum out the mouth? Lol, lol, lol. Up the bum out the mouth. Um, I'll have to prepare a craft for next time. Please do another, another time. I will, I will. Well, I say I will. I don't know. <laughs> I'll decide afterwards, see how I feel about this one. So I'll take this necklace off because it's um bothering me. Oh, well, yeah, now we can really lean into this. So... I'm glad I had my nails done, otherwise chip nails with this, this much pressure. Mm, trying not to pre-select fish, but I have just, I don't know if I want that one. Yes, I do. Then we can go for a lighter one next time. And then we're going silver. In a second, I'm going to look at the comments, so make sure you're ready with a good one. I'd like a progress report on your crafts. How's the girl that was trying to write an essay going? Um, and how many of you were here at the very beginning and have stuck around the whole time? I know it's hard to stick with a live, isn't it? Right, up the bum. Come on, open your bum. There we go, up the bum, out the mouth. How are we doing? Yes, perfection. So I'll just add the spacers and the natural there and tie it off and that will be Done and dusted, kippers and custard. How are we getting on? Not today, Satan. I've been here, been here since the start. Jennifer says, I'm loving this live. Thank you. I'm amazed at how many people have stuck around for this live. I thought that maybe 100, 200 tops would want to be here because you've got to be into crafts to want to be part of this kind of thing. But maybe this is quite nice. This sort of like hour is nice to have on in the background. Okay, right, so now we're going to tie it off. So I like to have sort of four or five good inches at the end there. There's my little nail skizzers. Here they are, like so. And then remember, how do we do our knots? We do uppy over and pull it tight. Not too tight, you don't want to like ram it because then you'll go over the beads and then that becomes a problem. And then Turn it around. I've done that. I have rammed it. Yeah. Then uppy over. Pull it gently tight. Gently, 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 gently. Tight, 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 tight. Then you want to do a loopy round and pulley through. Kind of helps if you've got medium length nails because you can like scoop it with your nail. Pull that tight and then pull it apart and tight like that. And then I will just do another uppy over and then another uppy over just for good measure 
then I'll just give it a little ch -ch 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 tug all the way around just to make sure it's good, looks good to me. And then cut it off as close as you can. And in your trash, and there we have a little BBB for Brogan, Benji and Bonnie fishy bracelet. How cute is that little glass fish beads? Hope you like that. She says, it's pretty. I love it. Thank you. That's all right. Brogan was so helpful earlier. She's given me all sorts of tips for how to do a live because it's been so long. I will say that could do with another little trim. Let's make that a bit neater. Oh, my innard has fallen out. Oh my God, I've had these for so long. Don't fail me now on a live, guys. There we go. Let's just trimmy trim. Happy with that. Save you guys. No bead gets left behind. And then I have these little organza baggies. So I'll put that in there and save that for the next time I see Brogan. Okie dokie. Let's see. Can you do a close up of it? Do you want me to do another close up like up here? I can do. Um, four Sparkle Green Star says hello. Um, Lauren says, you're making me want to try bead making close up. Okay, um, how can I do this for you? So, there we go. And then there's the bees with, oh, we're upside down. Sorry guys. Um, I really just like that they're gold and the spaces are silver, but next time I'll be more prepared. And then there's the beads there. We've got a little silver spacer, then the natural stone bead, and then the glass fishy. You like that? What do you think? Um, oh, Mia says we made mummy daughter bracelets. I love that. That's so nice. Okay, we shall put this away. Um, next up, I'm going to make a little bracelet for my friend Lara. I don't know if you're still watching Lara. I know that you have things to do this evening, but if you are, I'm making you one. If you're not watching, I'm still making you one. But let's just get tidy. I think we're going to use clay beads. I'm aware of the time as well. Does everybody want to get off at eight o'clock exactly? Or if this runs over, will you stay and watch a bit longer? Or do you want me to like wrap it up at eight? Oh, that's nice. Let's put my little fishies away. I don't like to waste beads. I really do not. Um, I also don't like them in these packets, but I've got a spare box here that I've been decanting into. So I think we'll start a little slot for those. Um, stay, stay, stay. Oh, but it's almost nine. Oh yeah, why am I saying eight? I meant nine, sorry guys. My brain's in bead mode. Okay, hang on, let's get these little guys. You can live in there now. I have got some lovely, lovely gummy bear beads. I'm really excited for those. And then I'll just put my spacers away. Most of the bead kits I have are from Amazon, if you are interested. I just type in little different search results, like beads, gold beads, plastic beads, star beads, like anything I think of with beads. I type it in, natural beads, whatever you want. Um, I'm loving that you're doing more on YouTube lately. Thank you. Um, Someone, someone says, 854 people are still here. This is good going. <laughs> oh, someone says the video's gone funny. Oh no, so it's gone, it's all right my end. Um, sometimes if my internet's not working, I just shake my laptop, I go like that. And then miraculously, it works. Um, I don't think that's good advice. Maybe don't do that. Right, for my lovely friend, Lara, I'm going to do the words Iona because we are both going on the Iona ship this year. Um, I think it'll be for her first time on the ship and my second time. I'm thinking I am going to just do, no, I'm going to do the coloured beads again. Um, so I like the colours of those a lot. Oh, Lara is here. She says, yay. Okay. Do you want table or face whilst I work out what beads? I'm going to have a little break. You tell me, do you want table or face whilst I map out all the beads I'm going to use? Let me know. Sarah says she just got back off Iona and she, did you like it? Um, Vicky went on Iona in May. Woohoo, hello from Jersey. Table says Corey. Table, we've got two tables, three tables. 
today's table. Most of you said table, so I am, we're gonna go for table, like so. Oh, hang on, Darcy's just messaged me one second. Oh, she just said lol. <laughs> okay. So, I want to find the letters for Iona, but I want them to be in like C color. So there's I here. Um, there's an O. I don't want them all matching next to each other though. I want a bit of a variant. There's an N. There's an A. If I can find a different I or O, I'll be these because I like it to look a little bit. There's a different I. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Perfect. Did you know that all of the ships, the Pino Cruiser ships, end in A? If anybody can name all of the ships, I'll be very impressed. I feel like Brogan probably could. No, no, not that one. Let's just have a bit of bead ASMR. Oh, that was nice. We're going to go for gold spaces this time. These are my good gold ones as well. I've got other gold ones in this set, but these are like my good golds. Hope you enjoy that, Lara. Little two finger scoop there. Right, these are my clay beads and I know that Lara prefers neutrals. I mean, I'm not sure how neutral any of these colours are. Um, oh, Brogan says, Britannia, Arcadia, Aurora, Azura, Iona, Ventura, and Avia. So I knew you would know. Um, I'm going to go for as neutrally as these colours are. Okay. When I do colours, I do try and, like, kind of map it out just a little bit. Not exactly perfectly, but just so I can see where I am with things. So, scooch you guys down a bit. I'm going to go for some of these colours. I think she'll like these. Lauren, this will be really awkward if you don't like this. You will now have to wear this on the ship every single day. Um, what would go with this? Bear with. We've got more of these little guys. We've got some more neutrals here. Let me just have a little think. I just think that that's... Lara, how neutral does this have to be? <laughs> I, don't, I don't think we can do neutrals. <coughs> Go for a little bunch of those and a little bunch of those. Snuck a bit of pink in there. And then we're going to go for a little bunch of these. A little bunch of these. We're going for more greenies than we are blues. Or should I make this a bit more blue? Can everybody have a little shout? Um, maybe go for ocean colours. Yeah, I've ended up going a bit green. Put these back. Good shout. Thank you. Thanks for your help, guys. Where would I be without you? Put those back. We'll go for a bit of these. A few of these. A few of those guys. from the day. And then I was thinking I want something a little bit fun in between. We could either go for some little fishy guys or we could go for some stars. What do you think of these? There's little stars here. They're quite nice aren't they? We have already had the fish. Um, we do also have 
pearls. I think that pearls look really nice with clay beads. I think what we'll do is we will surround the word with a star on each side. I think that will set that off nicely. And then we will have some pearls to separate the clay beads, like so. Mm. And then we've got the gold as well. I feel like I'm being really rude because I'm not talking to you. How are you all doing? Something different, love the stars. Also the, co the camera quality is gone, someone has said. Can't really see them. Hmm. Um, something different, do the stars. Yes. Um, I think that my internet is struggling, guys. Maybe it's because we're approaching an hour. We might have to make this bracelet off camera and then show you it on Instagram. How about we do that? Um, because there's nothing changed with the internet. Um, just think maybe it's struggling. What do you think? I think probably I will make this. I'll share it on Instagram with you if you're interested. And let's wrap up. It's gone a bit pixelated, but hopefully you can hear me. I would love to know. Um, how you've gotten on with your crafts, have you done any crafts, um, would you like to do this again another time and if so when's good because Monday nights I think will be good for me, I'm just thinking what clubs we'll have on when it's school time but Monday nights I think are quite nice um, but let me know um, and I'll also think of a hashtag and I'll put that on my Instagram as well so that you can share any of the crafts that you've done or should we think of a hashtag now? Like I'm just thinking LP craft party. That'll do, won't it? Should we do LP craft party? Um, all right, thank you so much, everyone, for coming. I have really, really enjoyed your company. These comments are so. Oh, people are saying the camera seems fine now. Uh, no, I think we will call it a day, otherwise, we'll be here all night, won't we? Because I could do this for ages. Um, let's do it again. Um, LP craft party. Thank you, Fiona, for putting in there. Appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. I have loved this, and I will see you all soon, hopefully, on Instagram, where I'll put this in a little while. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye. Don't know if I'm ending it.